That's one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. According to new research, about one in ten Canadians believe Neil Armstrong's famous step down was actually a giant leap in deception. Add to that the more recent belief that COVID was developed as a bioweapon and its sister falsehood that governments are covering up dangers about the vaccine. About a third of Canadians appear to believe in both of those things. Since the advent of COVID, we, we saw a tremendous leap in the belief in conspiracy theories. Steve Mossop's latest Leger poll turned up staggering levels of belief in things that either aren't supported by evidence or are just plain wrong. Take the assassination of President Kennedy, the classic rock of conspiracy theories. Leger found 36% of Canadians believe it was a cover-up. Similar for the death of Princess Diana. 34% told Leger they have it on good authority that Diana's death was not accidental. Category you are eight. fake news. Sir, go ahead. Can you... And since you're watching this on the news, you ought to know that a whopping 55% of Canadians now believe the mainstream media manipulates the information it puts out. With COVID and with President Trump calling fake news, there's been this erosion of trust, uh, uh, the perception of media, not only in our country, but in the USA as well. So what's driving the tendency to believe in chemtrails or a flat earth, especially in an age when it's never been easier to get information? Mossop suspects the single biggest driver is the way social media algorithms work to reinforce what you know or what you think you know. Every time you turn on your phone and look at something for, for fun, it's reinforcing what you currently believe and takes you even further. In Vancouver, Paul Johnson, Global News.